And I'm going to ask Chad, one of our pastors, to come out here on stage with me just for a moment, um, joined by special guest, Jared McCroy, who leads Children's Hope. And while they get in place, uh, maybe it's your first time here today, and I get to tell you a fun little background about why they're out here right now. Uh, we did a special offering as a church back during Christmas. We had five ministry initiatives for $100,000, one of which was Children's Hope, a ministry that focuses in the nation of Haiti, orphanage, schools, lots of great ministry happening not in a city, but really kind of out like in the mountains. And so um, this is Jared, by the way. He leads Children's Hope. And Jared is here local. So that's kind of cool for us. We get to have a global partner who also is here local. And so um, we challenged everybody. I mean, you guys were crazy generous. And so not only did $100,000 come in, uh, and we're going we're gonna, we're gonna to cheer for this one more time. And then I'm not going to talk about the money one more time, but I just cheer about it every time I say it. So you're going to cheer one more time, right? This is your heads up. We don't have like an applause sign, right? This is your heads up. We brought in 150 $58,000, all right? So that's awesome, all right? That's right. You're fired up. Spike that hymnal again, right? All right, so you're fired up. Now, we brought in all this money. We're like, what are we going to do with the extra money? And you had told us that y'all had a special one-time need, and that was a truck. And so if you can imagine a little bit more mountainous terrain, and you're trying to get around to the orphanages and the schools, they had a need for a new truck, $50,000. And we said, hey, if, if by God's grace and the people here, the generosity, if that happens, then maybe we could be the church to meet that need. And because of you guys, because of your generosity, we were able to get, we are able now to present you with a check for $50,000 for the purchase of that truck. And we were really fired up about that. And that big check, that was my idea, all right? So like, I wanted a big check. I have no idea if you can cash that. So hopefully we'll get you a real check. But um, you're here today, of course you're here today, but you're also here today out in the lobby with a table set up. So I'm going to let you go ahead and make it. Y'all give Jared one more, a hand one more time as he leaves. Man, that still fires me up, right? My goodness. This is when ministry is fun, right? Buying trucks in Haiti. Come on, sign me up for that every time. So he's going to be out in the lobby um, just right outside Tunnel B. And I, I would encourage you to swing by there. Learn more about Children's Hope. Again, it's a new ministry partner of ours. And um, we're really hoping, praying that we're going to get to go uh, sometime this year, take a team from Vaughn Forest. We're still obviously having to monitor everything like everybody else. So we'll be in prayer that that happens. But in the meantime, there's certainly things that we can be involved with as they continue to really do what we talked about today. I mean, everything that happens with that ministry is a, a practical obedience to what we looked at from the story today. So really excited about the work there, really excited that we get to partner with them. So thank you for everything you did for the special offering.